Bree's udder looks much better today. So they're nicing off both sides nice now. Oh, you goats are making everything giggly. Are you girls taking turns? <laughs> What about you, Miss? How you doing? Just fine? Oh, good. Oh, my goodness. She's beautiful. Hi. You're gorgeous. <laughs> uh, is it your turn, Miss? Or is it you trying to get? <laughs> she has triplets, so <laughs> they, they have to share. <laughs> You're so cute. What do you want from me? Some pets? Hi. Hello, gorgeous. You're <laughs> so fine. Yes, you are. Hi, dear. What is that? Good morning to you, precious. So beautiful. So beautiful. Oh, my gosh. What's going on, Missy? I got the itch. There she is. Hi. Hi, gorgeous mister. <gasps> Hi, little one. Hi, you're so cute. She's beautiful. Hello, precious. She's a fine girl. Yes, she is. Hi. What? <laughs> you want me to pick you up? I absolutely will.
Louis is not in heat, so he's annoying her. Hi. Tell everyone that you probably got Bristol pregnant yesterday, which I wanted him to do, but not until December because I'm not a fan of having babies when it's freezing. But we have a big shop and we'll just set up a playpen and have mama in there for a few days with her babies if it's that cold when she delivers. He's gonna make some pretty babies. He's a beautiful boy and he's awful sweet. And there's just nothing cuter than watching him act like a buck when he's just a baby. <laughs> You're so funny. Over here looking to see if I have treats. Beautiful. Good morning. You eating some broccoli? It's delicious. She loves it. Hi, baby. You're such a beautiful girl. Nothing better than a clean, cold pool to take the dirt and put it in. <laughs> you sillies. Oh, they're eating my little, my little sprouts. That's why we put the fencing up so we could change pastures as we go back and forth. Because geese love those little new sprouts and then they pull them up from the roots. found the, the little sprouts from the pasture grass. Unfortunately, she'll eat them all completely, complete with root and that keeps them from growing back. So we'll have to replant on this side when we, when we move them over there, once that has time to really, really, you know, settle in that grass. That is the most likely soon to be mama with Briar right there, Bristol. They run from the geese. <laughs> That's my BJ. Do you get away from those geese fast as you can? <laughs> So thankful to see my pasture filling in. My husband got this beautiful fencing up for me, like within a week of when I asked for it. He's so good. Just so nice to have pasture coming in on the other side there. Beautiful. Hi, sweet Bristol. Bristol. She makes gorgeous babies. That's Bliss's mom. But with Briar, they don't have any possibility of being cold or blue eyed. There's the new ones. They 
take their naps under there after they hippity hop and get some milk. They go under there for a nap while mama browses around. My little coral blue guinea hen, she goes anywhere she wants, whether we like it or not. <sighs> Here's the girls. There's the mama Bree getting some yummy hay. Hi, sweet angel. Bliss always eats from the middle. The briar. Is it delicious? And there's Birdie, Burley and Betty trying to figure out how to get on the other side. <laughs> but in truth, though, they do lay on this peacock porch during the day in the shade. Getting a fresh drink out of the cold pool before the geese foul it. Hi, you headed back to your pool? Well, hi, Burley. The geese eat hay too. They nibble on on the hay. <laughs> Burley gets up there to get the hay from the top. Boy seats from the middle. <laughs> they all have their preferences. Hi, you going to your pool? Head it over. Filling another little one too. They like they like to just float in it. And that one right there is Dixie. And that right there is her mama, Kenzie. Kenzie comes from Kentucky from a good friend of mine, Matt and his wife, Sarah. 